Hey guys, we're in Austin, Texas, and I just shot a video here at one of Matt Reisinger's uh, job sites. And it's a really cool sump system that they had to come up with to solve an issue with a basement. They just don't build with basements here. Uh, and they had an issue with sewer elevation, basement plumbing and whatnot. So normally you do a sewage ejection pit, right? Well, there was a little more to it on this one. So let me turn the camera around here. All right, so you can see this, we're on the back side of this house. And this right here is a big uh, natural light well. And they did some pretty cool stuff with some uh, sump pits here. The base of this natural light well, they're gonna put some grading over the top of these tanks, but that tank over there on the left or on the top of the screen is uh, for sanitary sewer ejection and that two inch pipe coming out of it is the uh, exit pipe coming to the uh, discharge. We got a vent, uh, another, the other two inch coming out of the wall into the top of the tank. And then that three inch pipe there going into the tank is the plumbing, uh, the sewage pipe coming out of the house. So you've got a, a grinder pump in that big basin and it's pumping up, tying into where the sewer actually exits the house outside of the house. So I don't normally see that. But see that four inch piping, actually that might be five inch, believe it or not, four or five either way. Uh, coming out into that Y, 90 and out of the wall, and then over to this tank. That, along with that six inch PVC right there, dumping into the tank, is all taking care of rainwater and area drain water from like the uh, patios, stuff like that. This The footprint of, of this house actually makes so that there is no place to put the rainwater as it's coming off of the house. Uh, out of the gutters and into the um, the scuppers or the wastewater piping that they've roughed in outside of the perimeter of the house. It's all dumping into that tank and then it's being pumped out. There's duplex pumps in that tank. So you can see those two ball valves, the two inch, the blue handles going into this concrete right here. All right, duplex pumps coming out of that rainwater tank and pumping out into out to the street actually right at uh, manhole so pretty cool uh you can see that square sub pit that was fr um framed up in formed up into the concrete there's discharge from a standard um uh two inch sump pump just to take care of the water that's going to collect in this this uh light well and then they're going to be putting some uh, poly grading in there with access ladder from the uh, top wall here down into there. I'd estimate that's probably about 15, 16 feet maybe. I'm guessing on that, but pretty cool solution. We just shot a big video on this for the build show. It'll be uh, one of my weekly videos coming up, so check it out.